You. <laughs> that was chaotic. It's really <laughs> I love good. It. You <sighs> son of a bitch, Barkley. He's even shedding Get a tear. Get the fuck away from him. Yeah, he's got a small tear. <laughs> <laughs> Do it, Jordan. You won today, Barkley. Yeah, you beat me. Fucking gloat. But I'll get you, Barkley. I'll get you and the rest of your goddamn sports lovers. And when I do, you'll fucking bleed Gatorade to your graves. I don't know what to say. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know what to say to that. Mission failed. Retreat to Blood Moses for reconstruction process and second attempt. So Vinceborg works for Blood Moses. I guess yes. so. Wait. But this is like an anime betrayal right now. It is, yeah. My God. Yeah. I am no longer Vince Carter, Balthios. I am Vinceborg, 2050, Blood Moses, Agent of Death. Vinceborg, no! Damn it, Vince. Damn it. Dad! I'm... I'm here, son. Barkley. Larry? I... I did everything I could for Hoops. Larry, don't talk. You'll reopen your wounds. I'm dead anyways, Barkley. Jordan got me good. Larry! I wanted to tell you I was sorry, Barkley. Sorry? For that... That argument we had earlier. You were right. Larry, you don't need to... I had no right to say the things that I did. How did we grow so apart, Charles? We used to be so close. I... I knew it wasn't you who did that chaos dunk in Manhattan. Charles... How do you know? Look at yourself, Barkley. You wouldn't hurt a fly. Not after what happened to Maureen. It's getting cold, Charles. It's getting so... Goodbye, Larry. No. Yeah. This is, like, <laughs> this is like the end of Act One. Wow, tragic. Mr. Jordan was... He was gonna hurt me, Dad, wasn't he? Yes, son. He would have hurt you if we didn't get there in time. But what did I do? You didn't do anything, Coops. Mr. Jordan is... He's not a well man. He's doing things he knows he shouldn't. That's right, Hoops. But we're not gonna let him do anything to you. You said we'd, you'd clear all this up when we got Hoops, Cyber Dwarf. Tell me what the hell is going on. The Chaos Dunk that destroyed Manhattan. It was Blood Moses. Somehow they got their hands on the Ultimate B-Ball. The Ultimate B-Ball? A long time ago, before you were even born, I was trapped in a basketball with a couple other ballers. You remember when I told you about this, right, Hoops? Yeah, the Space Jam. I remember. But what's that got to do with this? Although you were no longer trapped in the ultimate b-ball, Barkley, its power slowly continued to grow until it rivaled its original power. Somehow, I don't know how. The terrorist organization Blood Moses got their hands on the ball. I don't know what they are planning on doing with it, but from what they've shown us already, they are incredibly powerful and know how to use it. But... But who is Blood Moses? I don't know who their leader is, but I do know they've existed for almost a century. I think Balthios knows more than I do. No, Cyber Dwarf. I don't. What do you mean? Jake. Yeah. They... they killed my great-grandfather, LeBron. He was killed before the Purge. They shot him, Charles, right in the heart. I was at his deathbed when he told me about the Zobbers. I... I didn't know about the James legacy, that my father was the last to harness the power of the Zaubers. He told me to respect and master the Zaubers, but never to use them for an ill purpose. That's why Blood Moses killed him. They wanted the power of the Zaubers for himself. Themselves. I've been tracking them down since LeBron died, but... He's been chasing smoke. He can't find anything. I'm... I'm sorry, Balthios. I didn't know. You have nothing to be sorry for, Barkley. 
So what do we do now? There are two things, Barkley. Find out what Blood Moses is planning, and stop them. Well, how are we going to do that? They'll n we'll need to forge a new ultimate bee ball. One powerful enough to counter whatever Blood Moses is planning. I don't know how we'll do this, but I think we can find clues in the old Spalding building. Where's that? It's located underground, in Proto-Neo, New York. Proto-Neo, New York. So how do we get there, Cyberdwarf? We'll exit the town at the north, and then take a right. After that, it's a just a bit farther through the sewers. There's a ladder there we can use that descends all the way into Proto-Neo, -New, New York. And that's all we'll find it, the Spalding Factory. I... I don't know where all this is leading, but... But this can't be anything other than fate. F-A-T-E. We should get all the supplies we need here in Cesspool X, and then we'll take off. Good idea. Hoops has joined the party. Oh, we have a first time in the chat, and they're like, What do I tune into? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is pretty good. Uh, <laughs> this is the best video game ever made. Uh, Shut Up and Jam Gaiden. It's really good. It's an unlicensed oh fan game, and it's awesome. It's, it's, it's about basketball? Yeah, it's not about basketball. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> kind of. It's mostly basketball's illegal. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> it's a, it's science fiction basketball. It's about basketball, but it's about other things, really. You know, I don't think Vinceborg is one of the bad guys. There's a distinct difference between him and Jordan. What do you mean, Balthios? Jordan is a malicious old bastard who's trying to get to you for whatever perverted definition of justice he believes in. He's a son of a bitch and a sick person. Vince, he was a good guy. He was one of my best friends before the Purge. That's right. Even though he's a cyborg programmed to kill us, he's still Vince Carter. I'm sure there's some way we can get him to remember who he is. Remember that he's not a robot. Thanks for saving me, Dad. I don't know what Mr. Jordan would have done to me if you didn't come, but... But he's not a good man, Dad. I know, Hoops. He's one of the bad guys. And I promise I won't let him do anything to you. Thanks, Dad. I knew I could count on you. What we're dealing with, Walkley, it could spell disaster if we fail. I've dealt with Blood Moses before, and I know firsthand that they're serious customers. I... I want to thank you for helping me, Cyber Dwarf. I don't know if I could have saved Hoops without you. At least he's safe. That's what matters. We still gotta get to the ruins of the old Spalding building. It's a fair distance away, but the first step is heading to the north. And then right at the fork. Okay, let's get going. Okay, so... Yeah. I wonder what he can do then. You'll see in a minute. Barkley, wait! It's the turkey again. Zalatar, that's his name, yeah. What? <laughs> oh, that's right, so it turns back! There's something I wanted to give you before you left. Wait, what? Whether you want to admit it or not, Barkley, I know you learned something from us while we're here in Cesspool X. It's been a long time since I've been spoken to a norm, and oh. forgot how much we had in common. I mean, this is where we all came from. Everyone here was a norm once. What? You want me to give you a basketball or something? No, Barkley. I want you to know that you taught me to believe again. You've given me the hope to believe that someday, your people and my people can coexist. That someday, there will be harmony between our two peoples, and a band of understanding and cohesion that will go beyond appearance. I wanted to give you one of my precious turkey feathers to symbolize the mutual strength we have gained from each other. Oh, wow. Got one turkey feather. Turkey feather. <laughs> oh, I thought you wanted to talk to me about rebounds or something. Barkley, I don't know where you're headed, but don't ever forget us here in Cesspool X. Farewell, friend. 
Aww. Yeah. He was pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, I like him. You're like a weird jerky guy, yeah. A weird jerky guy, exactly. What am I supposed to do with this? It symbolizes the potential unity between these animal people and us normal people, Charles. Just throw it away, I don't care. We've gotta get moving. Right, let's get going. Yeah, they people, call us normie. Us normal people. Yeah, they really call us normie. <laughs> Wow. We're back venturing through the sewers. That's a dead end. I wonder how it smells in there. <laughs> Pretty awful. <laughs> Most this is likely. Like a, a massive, gigantic sewer complex. But, oh my god. Like underneath Neo New York. So we can't That be is great. true. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> this spider's so bad. Combat foes with a selected guns attack. There's that apostrophe between the word gun and the S again. What is this apostrophe? <laughs> oh, guns more than one. Ooh. Hurt opponents with guns techniques. So let, let me try Good. to remember his normal attack first. Accurate shot, rapid fire, mega shot. It's probably mega. What happens if I press? Oh, oops. I know I'm supposed to do that. Okay. Take a drink every time. There's some kind of we have to get moving. Or who the hell are you? What the hell is going on here? <laughs> I was like, I'll, take that. I'll take a sip of water for that. Because <laughs> you know that's the only thing I have next to me. <laughs> mm. I meant to get my gamer juice while I was on my break, but I forgot about it. Oh no, not again! That <laughs> <laughs> was your water danger, gamer juice. I have my water. I have my water. Uh, <laughs> gamer juice is something else. Gamer juice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the juice of the, oh my God, of the gamer gods. It's it's a fizzy drink. <laughs> oh, it's a fizzy drink. Yeah. Ooh. I haven't had a gamer juice in a long time. I'm holding out for a sponsorship. <laughs> <laughs> Not really, <laughs> but you know, no free advertising. Oh yeah. What is going on here? <laughs> Me every time on Twitter, I remember that. Everyone is annoying me when we begin. I think yeah. I'm dying. It was alcohol. Yeah, most likely. Oh no! We're okay. We're fine uh, still. Hoops isn't dead. He's just like asleep or something. Probably. He was hit by a status move, I think. I'll drink to that. There we go. Oh, he had a stroke. That's what it was. Oh no! <laughs> it's too early. It's too early for that hoops. There we go. Yeah, what, what did he just throw? Um, that was a that was a gun. Um, hoops, bad he's, hoops. <laughs> he's like um, he's like a gunslinger in this game. Oh, oh, hello, Wolfie. How are you? Hoops, you cannot. Oh my God, he's dead. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. I think that's Sprite is from Streets of Rage or something. Our like table. It's broken! <laughs> How are you, Luffy? How was your stream? Oh, I want chicken now! Yeah. I want some chicken nuggets. Rufa, I heard you've been complaining about some of the security station at the gate. I understand your grievances. As such, I've ordered another shipment of weapon weaponry from Square Enix Goya. It should be in by the weekend. They're quality arms this time, meaning although those rats can be a bit of a nuisance, there should no longer be problems unattributed to human error. Meaning screw up again and you'll wake up swirling around at the bottom of a sewer grate, and he'll be only a hundred little urchins ready to snap up what was what was your position. Don't oh, compromise hello. what little faith I still have in you, Allard. This Allard guy sounds like a real son of a bitch. Oh my god! <laughs> Ow. Yeah. I don't we don't know who Rufus or Allard are at this point, but there was a note. No, not yet. I just wanna do a guitar solo now. Yeah. Ah uh, yeah, my babies, the spiders. Too cute. Oh, that's cool! Yeah. Whoa, whoa, hoops! This is really pretty good. Dum -dum. 
Yeah, That's the cyber the dwarf is great. It's adorable. <laughs> they had to make that sprite themselves. They couldn't steal it from wow. somebody else. No, I don't think so. <laughs> Wait. My other achievement is an indication that it's my seventh and final stream needed for affiliate. Congrats on the affiliate movie! That's awesome! Did you just. Oh! That's new? That is new. <laughs> Yeah. Let's see, I'm just I'm trying to practice Hoops' moves right now. That's good enough, I think. I need a heal. Yeah. Right, but we have to go through the security station first. I think. I think that's what that was about. Sewer punk. Get it down to Proto Neo New York. You might want to stock up first. So people don't come back with some real horror stories. Anyways, here it is. So I can buy items here. Um, I don't need any of this stuff though. We bought that. We uh, bought that in Cesspool X. Contributed to the local economy. Oh no. Okay. Okay. How do I? Lively stalking through the shadows. His midnight obsidian skin shining beneath the moonlight. The drow ranger crept up behind the knoll and disemboweled him with his dual edged scimitar. Are you talking to me, kid? Can't you see I'm writing a drizzit, do Erden fan fiction? Or as the fanfic community <laughs> elites say, Ficky? No, no, not Ficky! <laughs> I saw that oh, tier God. list that you did with Zoa about the fanfic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll never say so, I swear. Definitely, absolutely. <laughs> oh my god. I'm waiting down here for my turn to be operated on by Dr. Alec. I've managed to save up <laughs> enough money to have my skin dyed completely black, much like that of the nefarious, subterranean race of elves called Drow. My aim is to have enough money to look completely like Drizzit by the end of the year. So I'll have to scrimp, sit, crimp, and save more than I'd like. You should probably. I should probably leave. If you want, I can read you some of my poetry about Drizzit. This one I like to call Ranger of Kindness. Ooh. No, thank you. Oh. D. Deflects incoming attacks with swipe. Read about him in a book. What? Your Oh, he's, this is the dang poem. Okay, whatever. <laughs> What did you think? I don't understand. Yeah, okay, let's go. I don't need to hear about Drizzit. Who's a real character, by the way? Um, he has a, like, he has a... He's like a Dungeons & Dragons character, I think. Really? Yeah, he's referenced here because his fan base is really annoying. Oh! <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> Something for my first business. Yeah, whatever. Okay, move on. Oh, do I extend me time to curse for What's that? Someone said, uh, Dina said, do I extend me time is a curse sword? Yeah, a scimitar. It's, yeah, it's kind of, imagine a sword shaped like a hook. Um, that's a scimitar. Uh, yeah. Uh, I am learning so much right now, geez. Yeah. <laughs> I get you now. I know a little bit about Drizzit. I think that he, he uses two swords, but I don't think either is a scimitar. Anyways, it doesn't matter. A eastern sword that is like a saber with a broke blade? No, it has one edge. It cannot have two. Ah, oh, I'm searching it up right now. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. That's it, Charles Barkley. 
Man, the doctor did a great job on your operation. You guys who get the Charles Barkley operation coming out look like Patrick Elling or something. That looks fantastic. Wait, what? Charles Barkley operation? Man, and you're already in character. You're a real inspiration, you know. Me? I'm here for the Wit Chamberlain operation. It's always been a dream of mine to dribble a b-ball in the vision of one of the game's greatest. I mean, just everything about the guy was amazing. His dunks, his rebounds, his shots, his passes. I could pretty much go on forever about it. I'm so nervous my dreams are about to come true. People get surgery to look like... Charles Barkley? What? Yeah, you're not the first. He's got a whole fan base of guys who've gotten the surgery. Yours is the best I've ever seen, though. He looks so real. Jesus Christ. Oh, Hi, oh my God. You gotta go. Okay, later, man. Keep it real. Keep this... it real. Oh, my God. Never seen you before. Dr. Raller charges 5,000 Neo Shekels for a trip down this ladder. There ain't anybody that comes here who doesn't want to get past me. There ain't nobody that does get past me without a lighter wallet. It's a decent situation we have going here. It's gone without a hitch for a while now, so... 5,000 gets you a round trip down the ladder, up the ladder once. How's that sound? What? 5,000 is an outrageous price. There's gotta be another way down there. Not a chance. Hey, up or shut up. Don't. Okay. I don't have that. 5,000? You must be out of your mind, punk. That's the price. 5,000 and you're not getting through. Dr. Allard's rules. So we gotta find another way down. Shit is getting real. I have almost a thousand Neo Shekels. I don't think I could get 5,000 even if I pull my gear. Mm. And I'm not doing that. Right. Yeah. Mm. 